hi guys welcome back to my channel thank you for stopping by thank you for the love today i'll be showing you how i made this tutu skirt for my daughter i used a four year old measurement if this is your first time here you're highly welcome and to my old subscribers i say a big thank you to you if this is what you are interested in then keep on watching please don't forget to subscribe to my channel turn on the bell icon so you'll be notified anytime i post a video this skirt can also serve as the perfect christmas skirt for your child let's get into the video so guys this is the fabric i'll be making use of this is my two this is two yards of two i won't be using everything and I have this plain one, and this one is one yard. And I have my lining here. I already cut out my lining because the length of the skirt I'm working with is 12 inches, and the waist of the child is 22 inches. So I already cut out this lining as 12 inches, which is the length, and I doubled the waist. That's 12 inches by 22. So this is 12 inches here, and I have 44 inches here. Uh, 44 inches so i cut it out into two places and i'll be making use of this elastic so now i'm going to go ahead now and cut out the two for this two that is one yard i'm going to be cutting out 12 inches by 16 inches because the width the yard of this fabric is one yard but it's by 60 so I'm going to be using that 60 inches now. The width of this one is going to be 60 inches and I'll be cutting the length to be 12 inches. So this is already folded like the way it came, you can see. So I'm not just going to scatter it. Now this will be the two that will be closer to the lining. Now I'm going to go ahead and cut out this one. Remember this one, I said this one is two yards. So now this one, I'll be cutting it from the middle. Reason be that the, the star did not get to the end. So I'm not going to use this end. I'll be taking it from the middle. So guys, I've gone ahead to fold this fabric. So I'm going to, because this place is folded into two, if I cut it as uh, 12 inches, it meaning I'm cutting two layers. So I'm going to cut max six inches. As I cut it, I'll open it so that you understand what I, uh, I mean. So now this is what I mean. can see is the full length you see because it was folded into two before I cut it so now this one now is 12 inches by 2 yards that's what I have here so now I'm going to go ahead and gather them I'll gather this one to be 30 inches gather this one to be 30 inches also gather the lining so the lining before I gather it, I'm going to fold it at the bottom. I'm just going to fold it like so. Let's sew it first before I gather the waist side. So for the lining, I'm going to join it together to make one line. And then I'll gather it to be 30 inches. Gather each of them 30 inches. So guys, I'm done gathering all of them. This is the one with the glitter, the plain one, and the lining. So now I'm going to step them on top of each other. So I'm going to put the lining first. After the lining, I'll put the plain one, and then I'll put the shiny one on top. So now this is it. I'm going to press them together. 
So when I'm pressing it, I'm going to leave one inch before I start pressing them together. When I get to the end, I'll just stop at one inch because this will enable me to close them separately. Normally, I would have closed them, like close this one like so, as in join the two together, close it, close the first net and close the second net before I'll step them on top of each other. But it's easier when you just sew on a straight line, you know. So I'm going to join all of them together like so before I'll close it. So that's why I'm going to leave one inch before I start um, joining them. So guys, I'm done joining them together. So I'm going to close them like I said. Now you can see, I didn't start from the beginning. I'm going to take the lining and I'm going to close it. After closing it, I'll flip it over like so. I'll take the first tool I'll close it and then I'll take the shiny tool. After sewing it, I'll flip it over to take the shiny tool and close it and then press them together here. So guys, I'm done closing it. And see, this is what we have now. So now I'm going to go ahead and cut my elastic. Remember, the waist is 22 inches. I'm going to detach 4 inches from it. So I'll have 18 inches. And then I'm going to take 1 inch for joining the band together, making 19 inch. So I'm just going to cut 19 inches. Now this is it. I'm going to go ahead now and close the band. So guys, I'm going to go ahead now and sew the band on top of it. I'm just going to secure the joining parts to the back, so the joining part of the skirt. So now, this is how I'm going to sew it on top. I'm just going to press it on top. So guys, this is the final look of the skirt. Please, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Share this video with your friends and family. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, guys. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.